Hi Commanders, welcome back to another Warpath Explained. Today, we will talk about howitzers. Howitzers are a long-ranged unit that boasts formidable firepower, making them effective against enemy troops from a distance. They deal blast damage and pose a considerable threat against enemy units such as infantry, rocket launchers, and other howitzer units. When using howitzers in the open field, keep an eye out for fast-moving enemy units that might be lurking around to try a stealth attack. Howitzers can be used for both defensive and offensive roles. They deal large amounts of damage when garrisoned against enemy units attacking your base, and they deal huge amounts of damage to buildings and fortifications. The Liberty Howitzer has formidable firepower and long range, making it effective against enemy troops from a distance. The Liberty Howitzer boasts a 300% fortification damage boost, making it the ideal unit when attacking enemy buildings and structures. The Martyr's Howitzer has formidable firepower and a long range, making it effective against enemy troops from a distance. The Martyr's Howitzer boasts a higher firepower than howitzers from other camp, making it a solid unit when attacking enemy troops. Antonina Shevchenko is a great officer paired on any artillery unit. She adds a ton of extra damage and firepower to your artillery unit, and when fully awakened, she adds one additional map grid to your artillery unit's range. A great officer paired with Antonina Shevchenko is Saber of the Nation. His tactical skill offers an extra 100 damage for every one map grid between this officer and the target. The Eruptor is another great officer paired with any of your artillery units. He offers a 25% increase in damage when attacking fortifications. When he is fully awakened, he reduces the load time of your artillery unit by 10%. Berserker Bear is a great officer paired with the Eruptor. When Berserker Bear is fully awakened, he has a 30% chance to set the target on fire, dealing damage every second for 4 seconds. That's it for this Warpath Explained. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.